got a little red eared slider in hand. It's pretty neat. Pretty tame here. Pretty cool turtles. I think he's peeing on me a little. That's awesome. But yeah, cool turtle. Let this guy back in the water, see what he does. There's a Karen over there yelling at my buddy for trying to catch turtles. Works for me though. I was able to catch this turtle, no problem. Undetected. Awesome. Sweet. I think that might be my first right here. And uh, yeah, here we go. Here's a yellow bellied turtle. Yellow Pretty belly awesome. slider. Yellow belly uh, slider. Thank you, Derek. <laughs> Pretty cool. They're very relaxed here. It's awesome. You want to hold them or? Yeah, 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 I will. Hold on. Let me get my uh, video going here. That's awesome. I'm going to get a video of him going in. Actually, let me grab a quick photo. Yeah, for sure. And then That's we'll, awesome. we'll book it because she's going to. Yeah, we'll, we'll head on to the next section because Karen over there is going to go. She's going to go tattle on us for picking up a turtle. Oh, sorry, bud. Let's get a video. All right, here he goes. That's awesome. Super cool. And you can see they're very tame. Yeah, there's, there's one right one there. Right there too. It looks like another yellow belly. We already got a yellow bellied and a red slider in cool. hand, so no yeah. point. So we have turtles everywhere over here. Currently like five or something. There was one more over there in the bushes. You can kind of see him. I think there's maybe even a sixth one back there, Derek said. <laughs> I don't know if you guys <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that, but this turtle is moaning. <laughs> that's uh, that's quite odd. I can't say I've ever heard one do that before. His calls seem to have summoned his buddy right here. Pretty interesting. And uh, yeah, they don't care at all about being touched. These guys are little moan while getting picked up. What's up, dude? Interesting. He likes it, I guess. The other turtles he are like his thing. paying it no mind. They they really don't. Care. Yeah, and everyone else is just like, yeah, whatever. Watch. I bet if I set him back down, he'll just yeah, set, set him back down in the same spot. He'll just sit back. Yeah. No. No fucks given. <laughs> so it's that. Awesome. So to that Karen who said we're disturbing the wildlife. Oh yeah. Go fuck yourself. Yeah, Look, exactly. This dude wants to be picked up. He's like, oh, can I have some? Yeah, go on, Derek. Give give him some love too. Come on, buddy. The Karen said we were upsetting the turtles. I honestly can't see them being upset. I don't know what you viewers at home think, but uh, I'd say the turtles don't care or are even marginally interested in being handled. I mean, look at them. They, they do not care. <laughs> what the hell? Did he just hiss at you? I don't know what he did. What the heck? Okay, maybe he's getting grouchy, but... But, but look, like, he has every opportunity to just, like... Leave, just yeah, leave, no. And he's like, nah. He'd I'm rather hiss and moan at you. Here. You can go ahead. You didn't seem like... See? They don't care. They no, don't these care. ones are the tamest yet. They're pretty awesome. I love turtles. Pretty cool. I like turtles. I like turtles. Is it catching that thing? Probably not, but we'll get it for the video. So right here, we have a nice chuby bullfrog. He's looking extra thick probably no chance of getting him in hand he doesn't think we could see him but uh pretty neat we could play that in, in his favor if he doesn't think yeah we could Just get real slow and then you want to give it a go garrett should Derek? i try i fuck yeah if you want I'm i mean i could try if you want me to i'll give it a shot i'd come from the right and try to just snag him you've been coming from low i think makes me look smaller as well I think he's going to get away no matter what we do, but we might as well give it a go. Should have went in hands first. I'm going to. I'm going to swing around. It's not even a good place to grab because of that fucking... Yeah, you're just going to have to send it through the branch. Aim where he's going to be. Just, you're going to have to dive in a little. Yeah, I'm going to. Smart move, getting the hat off. He still is acting like he's camouflaged. Your slow approach appears to be working. I'm gonna laugh if we actually get this thing. 
another one. We'll get this one. It decided it was retarded. It's still there. But there's actually another little fuck. <laughs> At bullfrog in there. Yeah, right there. Caught one. Oh, Thomas got a small one. <laughs> got a bullfrog in hand. Little guy. But there is a monster in there. Dude, look how slow he is. He's like swimming away. <laughs> I got it, Derek. I got you it. You got it? <laughs> yeah. Yo. Oh my god. Yo. <laughs> no way. When I saw how slow he was swimming, <laughs> I knew he felt safe. No way, dude. That's awesome. <laughs> That is awesome. I have a little guy here. But look at this fucking dude. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Look at that fucking bull. <laughs> look at this man. As I so often do, I dived in and uh yeah, I've got I've got the ultimate bullfrog here. This thing is a behemoth. I saw him swimming away real slow like and I figured Ah, eh, screw it. I'll, I'll give it a go. Derek's got the first one I, I got caught. The little tiny, little young guy. Look at, look at this. Don't talk to me and my son ever again. <laughs> yeah, don't talk to me or my son ever again. That's so funny. Here we go. Derek's holding both of them. Imagine he's pretty stoked too. I can't believe the size of this. Man. I haven't he's caught a bullfrog in forever. He he was being pretty lazy, and so I just dived right on him when he went into some thick uh, that guy, roots. This guy is seriously what a foot long. <laughs> he's he's massive, dude. <laughs> he's absolutely massive. I've never seen anything like this. That's the biggest frog I've ever caught in America. That's awesome. <laughs> Get some frog legs. Yeah. Oh, dude, he he got the good legs on him. <laughs> so look at him. He's just like playing dead. It's so he awesome, gave up man. on life. That's so cool. We got a little guy too. Yeah, that's awesome. This guy's getting kind of sticky. Should I get him some? Should I put him, stick him back in the water? Yeah. Did you want to take pictures? I or? do. But uh, should I wet him first or? Yeah, probably just dip him in. Careful. They get real slimy. You care if I release? No, you can let go of the small one. We'll film that. Here's release of little little broski. <laughs> Goober. I'm just gonna get this guy. You wet. gotta dip your frogs, ladies and gentlemen. Always make sure to dip your frogs every now and then. <laughs> Derek, the way you dipped him in like that, just slathered him a little bit. That is so cool, dude. Oh. I need to get some video too. That's awesome. Okay. I'll film the release, but uh, I'm gonna let Derek get some pictures and stuff. Oh man, look at that. He's beautiful. That is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna let Mr. Bullfrog back. Hold on. Alright, so. It's time for the release. One more size comparison on this monster. It's a behemoth. It's huge. It's time, time to let him go. Here, set him, set him down on the shore so we get to see him hop in. Okay, I'm gonna set him right here and he'll. Oh my <laughs> god! Holy so crap! Awesome. Yeah, he's still sitting there too. So oh cool, my man. god! Look at him. He's just right there now. That's awesome. All right, so we lost a, a racer earlier. Went into a hole before we could even do anything. But uh, I found this newt right here while we were looking for this garter who disappeared on us. And then I looked at the waterfall right here and he was right there peeking his head out and I managed to get him. Pretty sweet though, I actually caught a snake. <laughs> Stoked about that. Hopefully we can find some more. Come on oh, buddy. Man, I feel like two fucking weeks in this. So happy. Peyton, you wanna hold him? Okay, I just lost this bullfrog, but I found him again. Then we got the newt, and then we got the garter snake. Look at this, the collection. Put them all in the middle here, guys. Look at that lineup right there. That's sick. Awesome. The ones, all the ones I've had have been spazzy at first, and then they still have a little couple minutes. Time to let this baby garter go. I'm gonna watch him swim away. Deep. There he goes under that rock. He resurfaced. Look at that, that's cool. He didn't get enough air the first time. Now he's just kind of chilling. He's coming back to me. I love watching him swim. There you go, he's, he's just going to chill over there. We 
Oh yeah, there's a newt right there. He, he, he came back for the clip. This garter didn't musk on us one bit. That's a good garter in my book. There he is. It's the last we'll see of him. But awesome. Nice to get a snake, especially after missing that racer. So bummed he ducked under like that. But uh, you know, can't always get them. Racers are pretty tricky. So we found one of those water bugs with babies on its back. That's pretty neat. Never seen that before. Sweet. Hopefully we find uh, some more cool stuff. Oh, fell onto my shoe. Yet another velvet ant. This is the second one I've got today. He's a little bit more cooperative than the last one. Oh, come on. Come on, buddy, sit still. There we go. <laughs> Fell off again. But yeah, that's, that's a velvet ant. I hear they have a bad sting. Sweet. Yet another one of these guys. Most relaxed one I've seen yet. Let's see if we can get it to focus. There we go. You know, for the bad reputation these guys have, they're pretty chill. Sweet. Knew it was worth splitting up. Oh, well, we all just went separate ways, giving it a rest. You know, we were going to call it after losing the racer and finding, oh, look at him, he's riding his tail, and finding almost nothing um, aside from that garter. You know, I figured it's time to call it. Then I was walking past the bathrooms, heard something by the pipe right there, and uh, yeah, found a little gopher. Boys are right there. I think they are, they see the situation. They look pretty stoked, but yeah, gopher. You want to see where I found them, guys? It? It's gopher. Oh, go for some, how about you go for some bitches next time? Oh, oh. come on now. I'm just fucking with you. Oh, little baby gopher. I thought. Time to let little baby gopher man go. All right, buddy. You go on your way now. It's nice seeing you. Be safe. Stay off the trail. Our nice and arboreal right there. Oh, yeah. Look at him go. That's funny. I'm a little tap on the tail there. Oh, he's zooming. Oh! <laughs> now he's hissing, striking at me. That's funny. It's funny how I've noticed. I mean, I'm sure this is the same. If you have a snake out in the open, they're not. They won't hiss, they won't bite, they won't do anything. If they're like up against He's going them, straight they arboreal. Hiss, they, get they feel like it's a territory. Maybe it's maybe it's because they feel like if they're in the open they have an escape route. Whereas that's if they're awesome. up against something, that's where they go like, okay, I know First I thought it was a stick, but uh just hiked a decent alligator lizard. Booked it on me pretty quick, thought I was gonna lose him, but got managed to get a hold of him. So not a snake, but Still pretty cool. Boys are off on their own, trying to see if they can find one more. I separated from them to do the same, so we'll see if they turn anything up. But I'm gonna hang on to this for them. This little dude right here actually managed to bite me hard enough to draw blood. He's a fairly good sized alligator lizard, but damn, I was not expecting him to draw blood.